So you can't just declare a trillionth of a second without specifying a speed, or is that that particle at rest? So that that trillionth of a second is from the particle's point of view. So in the frame of the particle, so the particle's at rest basically. So if you were the particle, you'd live a trillionth of a second. But from our point of view in the lab, as you say, these things are going close to the speed of light, so they live way longer. And so this caused such like a big storm in the British, in the, the British tabloid press actually really got hold of this story. CERN had to create this health and safety report, which is the most exciting risk assessment you'll ever read. And it basically describes these various hazards, one of which is like a black hole that swallows the earth. The other is the creation of a bubble universe that expands to destroy the entire of reality. So they had this risk assessment where the destruction of the universe was one of the possible outcomes. And they basically said, this is very unlikely to happen. And so it's all fine. Um, <laughs> Mm. It's unlikely, and, and, and you still got money. They gave you. They still let you do it. Well, no one's going to sue you if you destroy the planet, right? right, right. <laughs> so, so he's already thought this. Through. Man, I'm telling so, you. So there's that. a YouTube video before the Large Hadron Collider was turned on, but there was a countdown to it. Mm. There's a YouTube video of the parking lot outside of CERN, and you have the clock counting down, and then it gets to zero, and then the parking lot falls in. <laughs> <laughs> on itself wow <laughs> and the whole it's a it's pretty funny i mean no, terrifying I, I,